a new therapy for type 1 diabetes has just been approved by the FDA. On 28th June 2023, Lantidra, the first allergenic or donor pancreatic islet cellular therapy was approved. Okay, so quick review. Type 1 diabetes is an autoimmune disease in which your own immune system attacks the cells in your pancreas that produce insulin. What we're doing here is infusing these allergenic islet beta cells into your hepatic portal vein, usually as a single infusion, so they can produce insulin for you, basically replacing the cells that your immune system destroyed. So who is this for? You see, some people with type 1 diabetes have trouble keeping their average blood glucose within range and they end up having repeated episodes of hypoglycemia or low blood sugar. That's where this therapy comes in. But is it safe and is it effective? Two non-randomized single-arm studies were conducted with a total of 30 participants. Of these, 21 of them didn't need to take insulin for a year or more. 11 didn't need it for 1 to 5 years and 10 of them didn't need it for over 5 years. Finally, there were 5 participants who didn't achieve any insulin independence. The most common adverse reactions were nausea, fatigue, anemia, diarrhea, and abdominal pain. Most of the participants experienced at least one serious adverse reaction related to the procedure and the use of the immunosuppressive medications. You need to take immunosuppressive medications with this therapy to stop your immune system from just destroying the cells that you gave. Some of these adverse reactions were so bad that they actually needed to discontinue the immunosuppressive medications. After which, of course, the therapy failed because your immune system destroyed the cells. So all of this needs to be taken into consideration when weighing the risks and benefits of this treatment. It's not for everybody. And it wasn't meant for everybody. But for those who need it, it could be life-changing.